Hello, hello, God bless you, my people, my people, my people. <laughs> Love y'all guys, man. God bless you on this thankful Thursday. I'm so thankful that God put in his word that we were made in his image and likeness. It is appalling to see how the world tries to class us and tries to shape and mold us and try to label us. We're not what they say we are, amen. We're what Jesus says we are. We are what his word says we are, amen. So uh, so uh, thankful for that because it's so easy to get diluted in all this drama and all uh, this castigation of uh, the, uh, the Christian faith and, and, and belief in God being savior and king of all, maker of heaven and earth, you know, everything holy. Is there's an attack against but you know God shows us that you know uh, he demonstrates himself in three personalities you know God the Father God the Son and uh, God the Holy Spirit and also we're made of three parts you know we're spirit soul and body you know and uh, you know our soul is made up of, of, of our thoughts our emotions you know what I mean it's made up of our feelings you know our uh, and it's so easy to allow our soul to dominate our life instead of letting God's word uh, dominate our life. In Psalms 34, if you have a moment today, read Psalms 34. I like when the, it says, I think it in the second verse where it says, my soul, I will make my soul boast in the Lord or my soul will boast in the Lord. Sometimes you have to tell your mind, your memory, your emotions, your thoughts to line up with God's word. Sometimes you're going through all these things and all these negative uh, impulses come through you. And sometimes you have to speak out of your own mouth. So your ears and your heart and your mind and your memory and your soul and can your spirit can hear you saying what God says and say, no, devil, I will not be convoluted by all this crisis, by all this attack, by all this combat. I will make myself boast in the Lord. The Lord is good. He's a stronghold in the day of trouble. I will make my boast in the Lord. I will lift my eyes unto the hills which cometh my help. My help comes from the Lord, the maker of heaven and earth. It is important for you to know scripture. Amen. And there's a lot of people that don't like uh, memorization or, or, or feel like it's religious tradition. It is not. When you believe that you receive the Lord, the Bible said you will be saved. So how much more will you be able to encourage yourself when you are saying what God is saying? Amen. So I pray that God would give you a word that when you're coming against the attack of the enemy and your emotions is going nuts, your memories are just flooded with all these things of regret and rage and all these things that you will make your soul boast in the Lord. And you say, I am his and he is mine. Jesus died for me. Amen. And I'm created in his image and his likeness. And I am beautifully and wonderfully made by God. Amen. I'm the apple of his eye and don't nobody got to like it. If God made you, he likes you. He loves you. He sent his son to die for you. And that is enough. Amen. Amen. On this thankful Thursday, God bless you and all those you love. I'm praying for you. I pray that you're praying for me too. God bless you. Psalms 34. Let's get it, get it, get it, God. Jesus name. Amen.